Yes. He made thee thought of gold, uh, blue and purple and scarlet yarns and fine twined linen. And they hammered out gold leaf. And he cut it into threads to work into the blue and purple and the scarlet yarns and into the fine twined linen in skilled design. They made for the ephod attaching shoulder pieces joined to it at its two edges. And the skillfully woven band on it was of one piece with it and made like it of gold, blue and purple and scarlet yarns and fine twined linen as the Lord had commanded Moses. They made the onyx stones enclosed in settings of gold filigree and engraved like the engravings of a signet according to the names of the sons of Israel. And he set them on the shoulder pieces of the ephod to be stones of remembrance for the sons of Israel as the Lord had commanded Moses. He made the breastpiece in skilled work in the style of the ephod of gold, blue and purple and scarlet yarns and fine twined linen. It was square. They made the breastpiece doubled, a span its length and a span its breadth when doubled. And they set in it four rows of stones. A row of sardius, topaz and carbuncle was the first row and the second row an emerald, a sapphire and a diamond and the third row, a jacinth, an agate, and an amethyst, and the fourth row, a barrel, an onyx, and a jasper. They were enclosed in settings of gold filigree. There were twelve stones with their names according to the names of the sons of Israel. They were like signets, each engraved with its name, for the twelve tribes, and they made on the breast piece twisted chains like cords of pure gold, and they made two settings of gold filigree and two gold rings and put the two rings on the two edges of the breast piece. And they put the two cords of gold in the two rings at the edges of the breast piece. They attached the two ends of the two cords to the two settings of filigree. Thus they attached it in front to the shoulder pieces of the ephod. Then they made two rings of gold and put them at the two ends of the breast piece on its inside edge next to the ephod. And they made two rings of gold and attached them in front to the lower part of the two shoulder pieces of the ephod at its seam above the skillfully woven band of the ephod.